YouTube, it's your girl JT, you guys, and I am back with another video. Back at it again. Okay, y'all, right now we have another South African rapper, okay? Uh, I swung by to one of my uh, comments and saw this. This one here is Julia Shane Eagle. Well, the, the name of the song is Julia Shane Eagle, okay? Shout out to the person that requested this. You know who you is. Shout out to you. Shout out to everybody that's been requesting me some good songs. I really appreciate it for real, for real. Shout out to all y'all, okay? Because y'all the best. Anyways, let's get right into it. takes y'all back to them like them real hip-hop days huh it could it, it gives that feeling as the beat drop and plus the video you know what i'm saying he don't have like too much of that jury shit on like it, it feels like that real good hip-hop vibes you know some shit to say look thoughts of visualizing heaven nigga we don't talk about hell as i got niggas doing life i know they burning that cell i know you niggas never oh let me run that back to say. look thoughts of visualizing heaven nigga we don't talk about hell as i got niggas doing life i know they burning that cell i know you niggas never heard of this shit this that make your fan base never heard of you shit uh. Heard they this that make your fan base never heard of your shits? Oh, oh, so he gonna talk. He gonna talk. Okay. Make your fan base never heard of you shit. Uh, heard they legalizing Mary Jane on the block. But you was quick to judge when we were smoking off the top. Uh, roll one. And I get lost in my thoughts. I try to picture life if I wasn't a rapper from start. Maybe college. Run and get myself a little diploma. I know niggas that have got it. They still chilling on the corner. You rap. That's real right there. That's real right there what he said. You go to school, get you know what I'm saying, get your diploma, but at the end of the day, sometimes struggles still hit. And I still see people that I knew from school, got their diploma or whatever, still out here, man, still struggling. And you you see a lot of people probably on the blocks and the streets hanging out or whatever, probably don't got no job. They probably were the smartest people in school, you know what I'm saying? And then probably life just hit their ass and, you know, Sometimes it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? And get myself a little diploma. I know niggas that have got it. They still chilling on the corner. You rap about the diamonds and never about the violence. And always about the jewels and never about the pools. Then my people still drowning in. Yeah. Rap about the, the, the diamonds and never about the violence. True. True. A lot of rappers out here. Shout to be just rapping about bitches and money. And like, we don't hear that shit enough. We don't hit like come on, we 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 hear the same thing every goddamn day. Still going on in today's world of music. Still. Every goddamn day. Now me, I'll probably listen to it on like occasionally if I'm like high as hell or drunk, but at the same time, music we supposed to feel shit. We supposed to feel reality of music. You know what I'm saying? Even singers, you know, they sing about realness, like what they going through, depression or reality. You got rappers just feeling how they feel because of what they see or what you know people could relate to their own music you know what i'm saying because we don't really we hear but we is we don't hear as much we just hear because everything now is so mainstream and internet you know so that's real and never about the pools then my people still drowning in yeah money flowing out it's never coming in yeah i see them hand picking all these niggas for the hit what don't you understand, young nigga? I'm the shit. I watch them all them change when they go and get a hit. Remember not to eat where you want the fucking shit. That's both label. I've got the game in the palm of my hands. I know that guy, he gon' rock with the plan. It's a 99. We 
want the peace, the freedom on top of the cheese. We want the freedom on the top of the cheese. We want the peace, the freedom on top of the cheese. We want the freedom on the top of the cheese. I get emotional to think about how far we done came. If you're not black, you don't understand the struggle the same. Now that if you're not black, you don't understand the struggles the same. That's what he said, huh? Let me make sure I get it right. About how far we done came. If you're not black, you don't understand the struggle the same. Now that's fact. <sighs> Listen, if you ain't black, please don't don't be in our shoes and you ain't black. Don't, cause it took a whole lot of years for people to get their own rights, to speak how they feel, to make some money, or to start their little business. It takes a whole lot in this world, especially if you black, even in America. Black men, black women, it takes a lot. And people want to be black, but when it's time to be black, y'all ain't going to be ready for that pressure. Trust. Trust. There's a lot of shit still going on and still struggles to this day. So, you ain't black and you don't understand my struggles and shit that I've been through to get to the point, then you don't have a valid reason to talk if you don't understand. Especially you not in my shoes, because if you was in my shoes, you probably wouldn't last a day. Shit, or the next day after. It's hard. I've seen how my people's held back in the trap. We tell them move forward, don't you do it, it's a trap. Praying for some strength of the things that I lack. That I lack, that I lack, yeah. Something's in the closet, never had the doctorate. Mr. President got the money in his pockets. My people starving, I'm my people's calling. I'm like people's marvin' on the Sunday morning. No one talking, now these niggas think I'm getting deep. Now my nigga, you too shallow. Moving out the creeps, I got niggas in the gallows. Yeah. The gallows, yeah. We want the peace, the freedom on the top of the cheese. We want the freedom on the top of the cheese. We want the peace on the top of the cheese. When it's on the top of my cheese. Feel Ooh, that's some true shit, y'all. Everything he said was some true shit. You know what I'm saying? Another South Africa, uh, South, another South African man. You know what I'm saying? Another Af uh, look, rapper. You know what I'm saying? Talking about the struggles and everything. It's still going on to this day. You know what I'm saying? I, I, sometimes I wonder, will we ever get peace in this world? You know what I'm saying? Will we ever make it? Throughout all this nonsense and bullshit, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes I wonder, and God forbid, you know what I'm saying? I may not be here for probably way in the future. It may come one day, it may not, probably not today. Cause right now, I, I just see just the same shit every day, you know what I'm saying? Same shit every day, you know what I'm saying? The struggles is really bad. And one thing I hate is really struggling. Struggling is the most part of life. And it, it can really hold you back from not getting to where you need to be because it's always bullshit comes so quickly that you can't even, you don't know what to do. You don't know what, you, you don't know what to do with yourself. You, you fall deep into the depression. You, you get, you, you start getting drinking. You start getting the drugs. And that's how everything starts in within that drugs drinking drinking drugs all type of shit and that's how a lot of things get caught with people when you see people right now that will probably in school the smartest getting good grades probably getting straight a's from elementary to high school i know y'all probably have some of y'all friends yeah that y'all probably graduated with strong out on drugs still out here on the streets begging for money some classmates you probably didn't see in a long time that's still stuck out here in, the, in this mode that can't get them get them nowhere because that's the only thing that, that they used to is being in the streets. And I've seen that a lot. Trust y'all, I've seen that a lot. I saw one of my classmates like that. Like that on that type of shit. Trust. It's real out here. You know what I'm saying? It's real out here. And it's sad because I feel like the world shouldn't be like this. You know what I'm saying? 
the world shouldn't be like this. We should be have to struggle and go through all this shit. We shouldn't have to be going through all that. It don't make no damn sense. It don't. Humanity has been falling ever since the beginning. Ain't no, you may have people out here that's equally coming together, no matter the race, what you is. But when it comes to terms of moving together as people, it should be always continuing to be like that because I feel like if everybody was to just come together just like that, this I, I guarantee the whole world would be in peace. But everybody's all about money, greed, politics. You know what I'm saying? And it's crazy. And your own people will shush up, shush up on you. For real. It's sad. But the song he was speaking in, true shit. A lot of true shit, man. But... Uh, I'm assuming that's his name, right? Shane Eagle. Let me see. Oh. Let me see. That's his name. Let me see. Let me see. Shane Eagle. Yeah, that's his name, Shane Eagle. Okay. Yo, born Rabbit. Rabbit Ridge? Rabbit Ridge. Andre in South Africa. Okay, Shane Patrick's. Oh, Shane Patrick Hughes. He was known professionally as Shane Eagle. Is a South African rapper and songwriter. He rose to fame in 2015. After finishing fourth place on the first season of Vuzu Rapping Reality Competition. Oh, The Hustle. Okay. Keep doing your thing, boo. Keep doing your thing. Bring that real hip-hop back. You know what I'm saying? Bring that real struggles back. Bring that whole life. See, people don't want to listen to that no more. You may have some people who listen to it. You know what I'm saying? And, and you know, there's still rappers out here rapping about struggles in life and stuff. Some people may want to hear it. Some people may not want to hear it. They don't want to keep probably hearing the same thing or the, being back into that mode you know what i'm saying sometimes it could be a lot of ways and a lot of different people because i feel like sometimes when people don't want to hear like real life situations they don't want to put themselves back into that trauma you know what i'm saying they want to just hear about the mainstream the pop and the life the money and shit because i feel like they made it to that point that's the only thing they could be used to people don't want to hear like trauma music or what people had gone through because Certain things people talk about in topics, I feel like they relate to that. So they don't want to draw their minds back into that. But people that's stuck in that mode and know the struggles, the the whatever they were going through in real life situations, it could relate to them because they could feel that. But people like that, some people don't want to be stuck in that mode. So I think that's why, you know what I'm saying? But you got to hear the real sometimes. It is what it is. But shout out, shout out to Shane Eagle. Shout out to the person that requested this. Okay, you got some more Shane Eagle, let me know. Follow my Instagram. It will be linked into the description, y'all. Pretty Poo Jenny. Don't forget to follow me. Request as many songs as you guys like. It don't matter to me. Just go ahead and do it, okay? If you guys have a whole list of songs for me to, 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 to react to, let me know. Send it through my DMs, and I'll be able to check it out whenever I get to, okay? I will follow back, and I will reply back, so don't forget. Hope you guys having a blessed day. Please stay safe out here as always. Spread love, be positive, all the other stuff y'all today. Stay tuned for another reaction vid. It's your girl JT. You guys already know what's going on. Keep it coming with these songs. Keep it coming with these classics. Like I said, I am enjoying it, okay? But anyways, I will see you guys next vid. Enjoy yourselves out here. Stay safe out here, y'all. Stay blessed. Peace. Love. Stay jamming.